And here we are joined back for the first Superliga men's of the Saturday night. We have Andinos versus Sterling Brothers Jinga. Currently a nil-nil affair. Very intense game as you hear both coaches going at it. We see for Andinos we have number 12, Seb Carrera Valencia. For number 10, Wesley Vanegas. Number 4, Oscar Di Gregorio. Number 5, Cesar Perez. Number 15, Juan Nicolas Serrano. Serrano. Number 7, Joe Miguel Usaga Castillo. Number 11, Miguel Fernando Salas Val Valde Valderrama. Number 6, Jesus Alfredo Caledo Os Osrico. Jaden Ashmore and Julia Bromfero, number one. For Sterling Brothers Jingle, we got number two, Zephyr McPherson, number six, Kalwar Muhammad, number nine, Ivan Palomero, number 11, Joshua Ban, number 23, Lutfil Muhammad, number 48, Kyle Davis, number 20, Sam Kermidi, number 21, Thomas McConaughey, number 29, Jude Bailey, number 28, Stron Burnett, and number 36, Bailey Pilton with number 11, Marcus Manera. As we have an exciting start to the game, I am joined here by Nishan Alagoda in commentary. He'll be joining us shortly. Vanegas. Vanegas with the ball driving up. And a good shot by the Andinos. Just wide of the goal. Davies with the ball.
at all. Vanegas standing over the ball. Good strike there from the Indinos. Deflection done enough by Jude Bailey. Rivera showing some nice footwork as he restarts. Or Serrano, I should say. Good ball to target. And number five, Perez joins no fabulous footwork. Beautiful defensive work there from Zephyr McF McPherson. Serrano now on the ball. Showing some beautiful hold-up plays. He pulls it down the line, but... Jude Bailey just keeping that out. Beautiful hold-up play. Just restarts back to Perez. Now with Serrano. Beautiful physicality here from Brazo as the Bulls launch long. Carl Davies restarting. Minara. Out wide to Belly. Now back to Davies. And, back. and a beautiful ball to Target. And we see Perez and McPherson going at it. And good... Good turn there from Zeph McPherson as Perez does a tactical foul. I believe that'll be a card for Perez. It will be. Of course, a long game to go. Perez needs to be careful. Another challenge like that will see him off the court, potentially costing his team. Ashmore organising his wall, checking every possible angle, as we know. Kyle will probably want to strike this one, Kyle Davies. Ball to Minara. No, to Davies, who brings back to the back post. And McPherson wasn't able to catch an end to that one. See Perez check out and Minara hitting it out. Number seven the end, is Castillo checking on. Worldwide shot from Valderrama. So McPherson checks out for Pilton as we see a four man substitution, or three man, I should say, is Ban and Mahanand on for Braza. Pilton, of course, a youngster coming out of the Braza Academy. Now we have a two on one. Can Vanegas finish against McConaughey? McConaughey with a beautiful save. As we see how much that means to him. Serrano. Ban upset that they were allowed to play that. Pilton. Showing nice defensive as Serrano takes a shot and beautiful block by Ban, but a bit of physicality as he's caught on that one. Foul called in the way of Ban. Referees just warning about the physicality. Ban to Muhammad. Back to Ban, who hits a ball across and good delivery to tip past the run of Vanegas. It's Pilton's now on the ball. Can Pilton turn? He does recover it. Good footwork from Carl Davis as he looks to skip past three and he just can't get past the third. Pilton restarting the beautiful thing about. Braz's team is that they can play multiple players at the target position and multiple players at the flank, especially Pilton, such a young flanker. Well, it's such a target that can play flanker, I should say. Mohammed back up and then ban, but Pilton can't achieve on that one. Press called early from Braza. Beautiful footwork from Serrano. And Heels from Andino's for a foul, but not getting the referee's call on this occasion. Muhammad back to Davies. Now Ban. Now back to Muhammad. Shoots from distance, and Ashmore had it covered. Ashmore restarting short. Ball going along, trying to find Serrano, but 
Serrano apologises. He should have been on that in his opinion, but the ball was in the corner. Now with Muhammad. Now with Ban. Ban looking to drive. Edge to take on by his teammate and just runs out of real estate. Vanegas. Allied to Serrano. Now out wide. Frendino is breaking the press successfully. They go down the line to Vanegas. Showing some beautiful footwork. Ban with a nice interception there. Can he finish? Ball wide. Ashmore taking his time. Happy to slow this game down. Four minutes left on the clock. Now ball with Vanegas. Showing some nice footwork. Now it's with Carrera. Carrera just shooting well to Serrano. Serrano down the line, but running out of real estate. Good pressure from Braza Jinga on this occasion. Muhammad back to Carl Davies. Back to Muhammad. Davies. Now with Ban. Ban's got plenty of time and space. Vanegas happy to sit off him. Mohamed, back to Ban. Nice footwork from Davies. Now with Ban, ball down the line and just not in his toes on that occasion. Gets caught. Play restarted to Davies as he drops the shoulder well. He drives down the line. Mohamed offering to restart to Ban. Now. To Muhammad down the line, to and back ball to Muhammad and beautiful save there from Jaden Ashmore, but a beautiful futsal play from Sterling Brothers Jinga. Tom of McConaughey says, "Well, though they should have scored from that occasion, but it was beautiful futsal. Seems to be knocking on the door." And dummies as Muhammad hits the back post, and now it's a counter attack opportunity for Andinos. Vanegas holding on to it for a second too long, as now he's getting capitalized on by the Sterling Brothers of Jinga. Wall of defense. Carrera slowing it down, playing down the line to Vanegas. Nice one two, and it's back with Carrera. He leaves it back for Vanegas, but Vanegas wasn't following that run. Ball through, and Ashmore off his line. Hits it right into the middle as Carrera tries to pick up. The slops on that one, but sadly can't. Ban, down the line to Bailey Pilton. Pilton skipping past one, but can't beat Seb Carrera, who hits it for a goal kick. Good pressure there from Pilton, almost picking goal up from the scraps. As Perez checks back on, and Dino's going long. Vanegas by himself. And shoots, and it was a beautiful shot in terms of pace, but just not on target. As Primero checks on for well, Brazajinga. Jude Bailey, showing some nice footwork, but leaves a bit short. Does well to recover. Palmeiro just can't get on the end of that one with his nice one-touch passing. Vanegas on the drive. Two minutes left in this is stop clock territory. Ben. Bailey doing well. Back to Ben. Of course, excellent hold up from Ivan Palmeiro. Skips past one. Jude, and a beautiful slaying chance there from Serrano. It was a very, very, very hard challenge, but he got the ball, and it was beautiful futsal. Vanegas now looking to drive, and now it's a two on one. Finds the ball to the back post to Seb Carrera, lays it off for Serrano and can't. Serrano shot shines full work, and the foul dictated by Ban. No advantage. And that will be a timeout for the Andinos. We will join you back after this quick ad break. Futsal WA has social futsal competitions five nights a week, Mount Lawley and West Perth. Whether you're an individual or have a group of mates who want to play, there's a junior, men's, women's or mixed competition that will suit you. Contact us to get involved in futsal, an action-packed sport and the fastest growing sport in Australia.
We'll have to see what coach Rob Mishlak has cooked up on the coaching board on this set play in a very good striking opportunity for Andino. See if they can nick the advantage. Currently a nil-nil affair with one minute 33 left on the clock. McConaughey setting up his wall well. Vanegas probably going to look to strike. Plays down line to Carrera and back post, but Bally checks it out as now Vanegas skips on himself there. Carrera trying to skip past, but now the ball with Alvaro Pereira on counter-attack. Can he find Ben? He does, but Ben can't get on the end of it on that occasion. And deemed as a foul by Car on Pereira for the tug. Carrera. Rolling foul. Good interception there from Sam Caminiti. As now Pereira is showing tonight's footwork. Back with Davies. Now with Josh Ban driving. Can he shoot? Gets cut out by Perez. Ben on the ball, gives it to Caminiti. Heavy touch, but Serrano just seen that ball out, playing it safe. Now with Bally and can't find Palmeira. Two on one opportunity, but cut out by Drew Bally as now it hits Palmeira's legs and he lays it off, but just can't find his run. 53 seconds left on the clock, still nil nil affair, anyone's game at the moment. Ball goes long and that's off the line as it's a beautiful set play opportunity for Braz Jinga. Ban on the ball. Now out wide with Cam Caminiti. Ban. Getting picked by Seb Carrera and Seb Carrera just Signed to go in for round two as he gives it down the line to Vanegas. Can work in Vanegas do? Gets a shot off, but Thomas McConaughey just does a near post save. Be a corner opportunity. Ref already counting. Don't think Vanegas is aware as he hits it to the back post. Palmero just running out of real estate on that occasion. Perez. Now wide to Gigora, back wide to Gongora, back with Perez, takes his player well, just runs out of real estate. We have 21 seconds left on the clock. Davies on the ball, now Caminiti. Davies, Bally, ball through, but Palmeira can't get on the end of that flick. Ashmore going long, finds Vanegas, his feet, does very well with that throw, and Vanegas standing player up, beats Ben. But good cover there from Palmero, but they both got sent, and we'll see what happens here. Good footwork there from Thomas McConaughey. And that will be half time. That should have been Andino's 1 0 if they could finish, but Brazilian got given a bit of a warning there. We'll see what Chris Castro cooks up at half time. And we will join you back after this quick ad break.
We're joined back for the second half. So we have Andino's drive. Of course, a very intense game. It's always going to be versus Braz and Andino's. Two very high tempo. My tempo players. First minutes for youngster Strand Burnett. Burnett, my apologies. Ball wide with Ban now. Ban showing some excellent footwork. One of the state's leads. Burnett playing beautiful ball to McPherson. McPherson dropping shoulder and just going for a nice driven shot, but can't catch Ashmore off on that occasion. Banigas and tackled by McPherson. McPherson with a massive challenge there. Ban taking his time. Both teams thinking they're on top, so they're happy to let the cl clock down a little bit and put pressure on the other. Braza. Moving the ball down the back three, of course. They love playing their target. But happy to play the back three if the opportunity is not on, and that's exactly what's happening now as they win the ball back. Burnett. McPherson dropping out of target. Of course, as I said, their targets are very comfortable dropping back if need be. Band down the line to Burnett. Beautiful turn there against Camposano and just running out of real estate. Of course, it's absolutely fantastic to see these youngsters get these opportunities at Brazza, one of the top youth sides in the state, let alone top A sides. Vanegas driving. Lays off, try to find Perez and a foul against McPherson. Number seven, Castillo. Just getting fouled there in the center. See if they've got a set play planned. Vanegas just considering his options. Pies wide to Serrano. Serrano showing absolute beautiful layoff and does well to Vanegas, but cut out by Belly. Now it's two on one. Two on two. And Dinner's doing well to recover back and a foul. Both teams appealing. But referee's not buying on this occasion. Vanegas playing right to Perez and Vanegas very good under pressure now driving and Jude Bailey does even better to recover for his team McPherson of course very accustomed in every position now looking to drive down the wide but just not winning it and beautiful physicality there from McPherson and giving it as a foul his way Brazo happy to take the time with this set play Belly now to Ban. Now with Belly. Cuts in, shoots, and almost blocked by McPherson's run there. Number two for the Andinos checking on. Now with Perez. Tries to get Castillo, does, but a bit of a very hard pass, hard to control, but Brazza right over there with that high tempo in the shot early, but just over, but it was a beautiful powered shot. Definitely was on target, it definitely would have challenged McConaughey. McConaughey's had to make one crucial save so far, and both keepers, are, apart from that, have been pretty, uh, pretty quiet game for them. Ball down line to Ban. Delivers to the back post, but McPherson can't get on the end of that one. Of course, it's always going to be hard going against his own momentum there. Ashmore going long, finds Vanegas, but it's going to be hard to get past Ban, and he does so, but Burnett always got him covered. Player he's down to Castillo. Castillo cuts in and shoots, but just lackluster perform uh, shot there. Ball in the middle to Gongoria. Number seven, Castillo. Now wide with Vanegas. Have good toe poke and beautiful double save from McConaughey. McConaughey fired up for this game. See it in his reaction. He's a little sap there from Vanegas. Very impressed with the goalkeeper's athleticism. Vanegas. 
McPherson cutting the line and just cuts it out. Good, good game awareness there from McPherson. Vanegas plays the ball to Perez. Now out wide to Castillo. Castillo now with Perez and McPherson picks his pocket. He's now driving. Can he finish? Oh, Ashmore does well to use his body. Ashmore distributing short to her Perez. Perez hitting in. Vanegas, but just can't keep it in on that occasion. There's now a good browser counter attacking opportunity from a set play. Burnett. Now with Minas. Now with Ben. Hits McPherson. McPherson showing beautiful forward and beautiful turn shot, but Ashmore's always got that covered. Now Vanegas is. On the break, and McPherson working backwards, but used his own body against him, and that's a beautiful finish by Vanegas. Toe poke to the bottom corner, and nothing McConaughey can do. Splits well, but just that toe poke into that bottom corner. McPherson, I was just about to say, does extremely well to recover, but Vanegas just does better to use his own body to toe poke that into the bottom corner. Brazo will be very disappointed. They've definitely been in this game, and see if they can recover. 14 minutes left on the clock. The score 1 0 definitely be. Ernest on them to break down this Andino's defense, which has been so strong so far. Good footwork here from Ban. Now Seb Crea looking to line up his opponent and just runs out of real estate. Ban, of course, very hard man to beat. Ball with Muhammad now out wide to Minara. Minara playing the ball across to Ban. Braz are very good at switching this ball across the whole court with their switch, but see if they can capitalize from it. Now we have Andino's on the break where they're happy to be. He's peeling for a handball. Minara with a shot and always wide from Gongara just urging his teammates to keep keep control of the situation as Carrera skips past and that's a nice one too he's got a wide man available but doesn't like for his option Muhammad now with Carl Davis and now Gongoro picked his pocket can he finish and he sends in the wrong way and just can't toe poke into the goals Dino's are really got to capitalize on these counter-attacking opportunities and just really got to put this game to bed if they want to come away with this victory cleanly McConaughey throwing along with a beautiful throw and just hits Carl Davis but Carl Davis wasn't expecting it in that position Struggling to get back. Of course, I know many of the Brazil players are just playing outdoor games, so it would definitely be a little tired. Ball down wide to Perez. Perez does get past and keeps the ball in and shoots to the back post, but no one's there. And Dino's very upset with themselves. They didn't capitalize on that opportunity as Caminiti checks in for Brazil Jinga. You can hear the intensity through the mic probably as Primary hits and shoots, but good drop in the knee by Ashmore. Ashmore absolutely instrumental in turning Andino's side around as they get sold once, but sorry, I was going to say the start of the season was so good, but Luffer got me with that sell as Carrera now drives, and that's a beautiful shot, but McConaughey didn't always had it covered. It's a corner ball opportunity for Andino's. And Dino is just the whole bench and three players complaining about uh, Ivan Palmeiras holding the shirt. It's Gongora almost hey, on a target. McConaughey finding a beautiful ball to Palmeiras and cut out by number 11. Seb Carrera now looking to drive. Eleven, Val Valderrama showing some support and just pass it to Sip Carrera who gets taken out and it'll be a foul. Be a yellow card to the bench of Braza Jinga after a bit of descent. Sano standing over that ball. 
urging to cut Valrame, shoots and good save from McConaughey. Good run and Muhammad just seeing it out. Back to Ashmore, Ashmore the calm part of Andino's. Ball over the top but can't hit Carrera. Ball goes long and Stephanie McPherson checks back on. It seems like Brazza are going for a two target situation here with Pamahara and McPherson. Not sure if it'll turn into a 2 2. We'll have to see. Good shot and just wide. Konicki had it covered. We will see two targets coming out. We're going to 2 2. One short target as they hit Pamahara, but Perez cutting it out. Perez now driving. Of course, Andinos don't have to score here, so they're happy to hold onto the ball as long as possible. But they still like their direct play as Perez comes out and Muhammad and combination of Thomas McConaughey and Muhammad clearing that one. So we see Vanegas checking back on for the Andinos, the big man. Campesano. Now with Vanegas. Vanegas skipping past one and gets almost gets past Kameny, but Kameny putting in a strong challenge there. It'll be charge and it'll be Against number 11, Valderrama. Caminiti standing over the ball. Seth McPherson looks like the one who's going to take the shot on this occasion. Vanegas marking him. Tries to chip, but just not on time on that occasion. Early pressure from Brazza as they, and Dino's look to go long. Nice header there from Primero, but Jane Ashmore always had that covered as skips past one, and Dino's looking to shoot quickly. Right now, real estate is McPherson puts a beautiful pressure on, but the one two beats him, and can he recover? Now with Vanegas, Vanegas cutting in. Now with a beautiful save there from Castillo, but. Sorry, beautiful shot from there from Castillo with a Thomas McConaughey beautiful save. Good length of deflection as the ball resets to Ashmore. Ashmore going long. Finds Castillo. Looking to bypass the wings as they go down the side. McPherson. Ban playing Palmero, but just can't get his footing on that occasion. Commandment Caminiti hitting McPherson. McPherson showing some beautiful body work as he turns and shoots. McPherson playing nice ball and the dummy from Caminiti for a Josh Ban shot, but just can't get past the wall of yellow on that occasion. Caminiti, beautiful back roll to Ban. Ban now on a one on one, skips past. Castillo tries to get the slide cross, but Castillo had it covered. Band giving some instructions to his fellow teammate. See Belly Pilton better be put on for Braza. Good shot there from Ban. Caminiti restarting and McPherson just blocking the goalkeeper. Shot from Palmero in the back post, but McPherson and Ban were both in two minds whether to go to the third position. Perez checking back on for Andinos. Vanegas going long and Kameni checking it out. But Castillo able to collect as he skips past the Pomara and skips past another one as big challenge comes in from Caminiti and Serrano with an even bigger challenge as now McPherson gets an even bigger challenge and it's really erupted here and that was a foul. Josh Bam will be getting a yellow card for that one and Four big challenges there in a short space of time. See this uh, game erupting a bit of cards. Oh, we'll have to see if both teams keep their cool heads. Wesley Vanegas standing over this ball. See what he decides to do. He shoots, but McConaughey sets his knee well. Now with Ban. Ban out wide to Pilton. 
Trying some nice footwork, but maybe holding the ball a little too much. Kameny out to Ben. Ben looking to take on his player. Does down the line, but just running out of real estate. Castillo just shepherding that one out. As Fanny Gas will almost always like to go long in this situation. He doesn't, but we'll see what Ashmore does. He does. Goes long to Campesano, but ball just a little too high. Konicki. Checking out to Ban. Ban skipping past one. Signed to cut in. Cuts in to Pilton. Pilton opening up on that right boot. Does a nice touch, but can he shoot? And Ashmore just saving off the post. As now Vanegas is on the break. He's been past Ban. It's two and one. Oh, and a good split save there from McConaughey, but I don't think he got a touch on that one as Vanegas just finds, almost finds the ball to Campazzano, but Campazzano can't slide on that occasion. You now the combination of Carl Davies and Jude Bailey on. Out wide to Pilton. Now, with Jude Bailey, Carl Davies just nicking past him very well. Yellow card for Campazzano. Michelak just urging his teammates not to dive in. They can't afford a red card. Giving some very important instructions here. A lot of emotion as McPherson tries to skip around him. And now Gregorio's on the break. What can they do? And just cut out by Carl Davies on that occasion. Of course, a big matchup in the next game as well. Three minutes 45 left in this game. But we have Cobras versus the Cobra Wolves, second versus third. And winner will take second, I believe. So, very crucial game. See yellow card coming out for Castillo. Yellow yellow cards here on this game as McPherson just holding up well. Now with Carl Davies. McPherson. Now with Pilton. Pilton getting pressed, but turning his back and getting his self pocketed, but just lucky on that occasion. Young needs to be a bit careful. He's holding it a bit too long to the ball. Carl Davies to Jude Bailey. Bailey putting nice ball to Pilton. Can he open the scoring sheet for Braza? Castillo doing a very decisive challenge there. Davies to Pilton. Pilton, beautiful pass there to Bailey as uh, Carl Davies does a nice back heel, but just can't get it to his target. Vanegas showing some nice physicality. Can he finish? He does! A beautiful goal from Wesley Vanegas. We'll see if that puts the game to bed. It'll be a timeout for Sterling Brazza Jinga. They said they'll go fifth man, I believe, and they were practicing it in the warm up. I did see that earlier, so it'll be an exciting finish to this game. We will join you back up this quick ad break. WA has social futsal competitions five nights a week, Mount Lawley and West Perth. Whether you're an individual or have a group of mates who want to play, there's a junior, men's, women's or mixed competition that will suit you. Contact us to get involved in futsal, an action-packed sport and the fastest growing sport in Australia. First and restarting. We'll see what Braza have cooked up. We'll see. I don't see a fifth man shot on for Braza. We'll see Castro happy to see how his side performs in the last two minutes, 30 seconds. Although, yeah, the usual fifth man, Josh Ban is on the court at the moment. Ashmore happy to go long. 2-0, doesn't he lose the ball? Just done that. Let's hope to minimize the transition for Dino's sake. Carrera now driving, and that's a two-on-one. 
Good challenge there from Jude Bailey. Is now 3v2. Can McPherson get the crucial touch? And he can't. Hits the back post to Ban. Can Ban finish? Lays off for Bailey. But Bailey just losing his footing. As now Gongoru's doing a beautiful, beautiful challenge there by McPherson. He's driving now to back post to Muhammad and can't give it back to him. What an exciting game it's going to be. The last two minutes if we continue like that. McConaughey absolutely fuming with his side that they can't finish on that. Beautiful passage of play. Almost did enter in a counter-attacking opportunity though, so they have to be careful. Ashmore, Carrera, going long, hits Gungoro, turns well, one-on-one, -on -one. can he finish? Good split save there from McConaughey, spread himself well enough that the only option was out for Gungoro. Ball goes long, Carrera just heading it short. Ban happy to reset from halfway, hits it to Lufa Muhammad as we have a 2-2 coming out for Brazza. See if this pays dividends on their situation, but Ashmore powering it out. Carrera. Vanegas just getting cut out. Now with Ban. Muhammad. Ban. And he got with the ball. Jude Bailey driving up the field. Taking on one. Tries to find McPherson but fails to do so. Free kick for Brazza. Josh Bailey with the ball, driving up, takes a shot, wide a goal. Ashmore throws. Anagas at the back, tries to find Kungora. Kungora with the shot, blocked by Hamanini. Harris with the ball. F finds Vanagas. Vanagas happy to just keep the ball. Side ball for Braza. Plays Josh Bond. Corner ball for Braza. Plays Josh Bond. Eight seconds left to go in the match. And full time match over. Andino's two, Brazil zero. See you back, and next time we'll show you the stats on the screen shortly. <laughs>